so again just so that the recording has started now mm. today i'll be mostly giving you an introduction about what this exam p is about so it's an exam from the society of actuaries which is us based right you know this thing and then as siddharth rightly mentioned that they have six sittings of this exam so it i think it it starts in july so in july you have one exam and then every alternate month you have another exam so in august you won't have then it's in september so it goes on like this so september and then not in october november so you have more than like the two sittings that are offered by iii or ifoa so are both of you aware of these two institutes iii ifoa yes okay yes, so sir. so clearly there is one advantage that you have more attempts that you can give in an entire year that is one thing for soa then are you also aware that the initial papers in soa like for example exam p or there is an exam called exam fm and then there is also this exam called srm so all these exams are you aware of like the, what the cost structure difference is between these two institutes so let me tell you there are two kind of fees which is there for these exams in uh, in soa they have a student fee and then they have a normal fee which is quite like the ifoa reduced rate fee and the normal fee right now few the initial exams in both these institutes ifoa and soa these are almost comparable like if not less so i think soa would be lesser for some of the papers as well also so that means it's not a problem from the cost side to enter soa and maybe the late, later papers that you have from soa the higher ones after you get the associate ship from the institute i think those are a bit expensive compared to ifoa but if you keep that in mind us time pay it's more likely that your employer would be reimbursing those exam uh, fees for you right so it's not on you so initially there is almost the same level of cost that you will have to bear in order to appear for exams and curriculum wise these institutes like i would say this soa ka jo syllabus hota hai the curriculum is more sort of evolving it's faster evolving than ifoa or iii so iii is exactly following the curriculum what ifoa has right are you aware of this iii ka apna khud ka koi curriculum waise nahi hai just that they have a independent uh, institute conducting exams independently but the material is exactly the same so now inka material thoda better hai for example jab hum log exam p ki baat kare isme there is a lot of overlap with the cs1 paper that you have in iii or ifoa as you must have already seen so i should almost say that it's 50 to 60% 50% to 60% syllabus of cs1 so it's relatively easier than what you have in cs1 so as siddharth was mentioning he has already prepared a bit for cs1 it should be a little easier for him till now do you have any questions also what about the exam so exam would be all mcq which is not like ifoa at the moment iii i think has planned from this next attempt so from november attempt november 2024 attempt iii would be also conducting the cs1 exam all mcq so soa already does it so soa ka jo exam p aap log jo dene ja rahe ho uska format kya hai it will be 30 mcq questions and you will have a time period of 3 hours and it will be center based okay so ye teen cheez important hai ek to aap center based aap pehle se apna exam book karke rakhoge then sare questions will be mcqs ye do exam ka details ho gaya fir फिर हम लोग इसके सिलेबस में जा सकते हैं अभी कुछ पूछना है इतने में टिल नाउ व्हाट आई हैव टोल्ड यू आर यू बोथ कंफर्टेबल इन हिंदी एज वेल लाइक यू अंडरस्टैंड इट ओके नॉट वेरी मच सर ओ नॉट वेरी मच इफ आई हैव एनीथिंग आई विल आस्क अगेन या या प्लीज नो आई विल आल्सो ट्राई टू ओनली स्पीक इन इंग्लिश देन नो प्रॉब्लम सो आई थॉट इट वाज मोर इजीयर फॉर यू गाइस ठीक है तो एग्जाम के बारे में यू ऑलरेडी नो and may i know which term are you planning for have you booked any exam both of you guys 
not yet. So November. So Siddharth has booked up for November. Okay, and uh, can we I shifted now? it. I put it September, then I shifted it to November. Mm -hmm. Can you book now for November? Yeah, yeah, we can book yeah, it yeah. now. You have, yeah, like, uh, I think it's mostly you can book until one month before the exam. I think that's what I saw in their official website. So that's yeah, pretty yeah. much so like what IA also. Yeah. Like until the deadline comes or something. Yeah, yeah. So you can, can book. For example, in the July one, I think there was this deadline for June of 18th of June. So that's like almost one month before the exam. Also, you can you have a range of dates. That's also one ex uh, advantage, I think. Right, Siddharth? That's how it is. So in a particular, for example, the July exam, it can uh -huh. happen between any day, like 19th to, let me show you. Yes, uh, yes. They have the exam window open. Yeah, yeah. So exam window, which basically means uh, you could, I think you when you are registering, you could select one of these dates when you would go to the center and then you give the exam, right? Because yes, this yes. is this gives you the flexibility. For example, if it's 19 to 23rd of July, that means based on your own college exams or whatever day you prefer, let's say, you could choose one of these and then go. It's not like a strict routine which is given by some other institutes. Ek, this is strict, hota na? There is keep a particular date mein hi ek particular exam hai on so you can't be flexible there but soa offers this flexibility so that is also one major difference okay so that's about the exams the structure and the similarities between the different institutes any questions not yet no okay no, so the the plan that we have is mostly we have the recorded recorded videos for all these topics so these are as i told you it's mostly 50 to 60 percent from cs1 like cs1 is more vast in terms of its syllabus Uska kuchhi part, some part of it is in exam p so if not like as i went through this syllabus i saw that most like around 50 to 60 percent of this syllabus can easily be covered from your recorded lectures so that's what we will offer you but it's not like since it's not exactly the same i will guide you as to what video to watch for what topic so you will get a proper guide from me guide as to which video to watch so this is what i'll provide you additionally for example let me tell you if you start with the general probability okay so they also give you the weightage for this. Is topic say how much questions can you expect in your exam? So when they say 23 to 30% out of 30, let's say 30% bull so eight to nine questions you can expect in the exam. So that's how it goes. 30% syllabus is a fair up dictate you have set function, Venn diagrams, etc. So yes, I cheese a calculation of probabilities, yes, I topics. So now what I'll do, I'll go back and look at what videos Praveen sir already has and then I'll tell you which videos you have to look and then when we have the class so we will have weekly classes once or twice in a week based on how fast you guys can cover up those videos so weekly we'll have one or two classes live classes as I'm having now and there you can do two things you of course you can have doubts from the videos that you're watching plus there will be question solving so I'll solve all the questions. So question solving will mostly be from the Actex. I'm sorry. Actex study material, I think, which you already have access to. Right? I think you have the link for that, right? Koshal had posted that in the group. So from that, I'll be solving questions. So videos. Gene topics, though for the topics that are already common from CS1, I'll be giving you videos. I'll tell you which videos to watch. Then secondly, when we'll have one or two classes in the week, we can solve all your doubts there. And then I can proceed with solving questions. So question solving will always be from my side. And doubts, there'll be no doubts that you will have pending. That's how we structure. So now one more thing, the new topics which are not there in CS1, 
the plan is i'll start them all from zero so zero se start karenge pura a to z theek hai isme sare questions sare concepts every concept all the questions that will be on me so we can go through it together understood so when i tell you about new concepts which are not there in cs1 uh let me check which one i saw some of them for example all these things here the concepts of deductible so it's a bit insurance specific all these things co insurance benefit limits etc or these topics so these are new so these are somewhat overlapping with another paper called cs2 which is there in ifoa but still since it is new and a bit difficult then the other topics that you have in this exam i'll be covering them myself in the live lectures understood so kaun se kaun se topics aapko abhi video se karne hai i'll let you know in the group today apart from that you know all these things material aapko pata hai kaun sa aapko follow karna hai so now you know what is the material let, let me know if you don't know any of these you know what the where you will find the recorded lectures theek hai then you know what is the meeting link we'll have so you have joined already so this will be the same meeting link for every class timing for the class will be posted in the group so keep note of that so group mein timing post ho jayega also one more thing whatever doubts you have please post that in the groups it's more for you than for me because if you post that in the group and if i ask so please post your doubts in the group post doubts in the group why because agar main if i tell you to post the doubts it means you will have that obligation sort of a thing ki yeah sir has asked me so i'll have to post it right if you don't post that and then i have a class let's say on wednesday and suddenly i don't have any questions from you which cannot be the case right you are studying all these for the first time you are watching a recorded lecture you can have many questions so wednesday ko class hai i would expect that if i take a class on wednesday by tuesday night i should have all the questions from your side do you see my point so because i will give you ample time to watch the recorded lectures and then i would expect you will have questions and those have to be posted before we start the class if the class is on wednesday i am repeating if the class is on wednesday i would need your questions by tuesday is that okay so that you also have a structure in mind you, you can also plan accordingly aap apne videos dekh ke fir questions dal do kyunki agar aap wednesday tak wait karoge that means let's say we start the class i'm pretty sure that you won't be asking me any questions theek hai to ye sari cheeze hai i think that's all recorded lectures and then yeah live lectures ka to maine bol hi diya where we solve all the doubts and questions that's all we have to offer for you in this exam exam p if you also need help about registering for the exam you can get in touch with people from aei they could help you out how to do that siddharth i think we didn't we did not talk about calculator with you right so which calculator do you use <clears throat> sir i have this uh... the texas one one second Oh, I could not hear you properly. I had FX nine nine one, but I didn't bring it. There. FX nine nine one. Yeah, yeah. So and uh, Tayaba, she had I think FX eighty two, ES, ES plus. Right? Yes. Yeah. So for these two calculators, I can confirm whether these are allowed or not. And then we'll also have a. So you must be wanting a class on how to use these calculators also, no? What are the different optionalities that we have? so we yes. can also have a class on how to use these calculators that would be a very short class we can have that somewhere in the middle like well while we go through the doubts class etc theek hai so now from our side i'll let you know where to start from i think there are few uploaded videos already up to joint distribution so that's quite a lot so those will be like sec like some topics which will be throughout this syllabus so mostly when you talk about joint distribution that is topic number 3 out of these topics mostly uh, i think a lot of them would already be covered in the videos but it's my duty to tell you which topic corresponds to which video right so that is something i'll let you know for now you can continue watching the video as you are doing please don't stop on that but once i give you the 
mapping which video is for what then it would be better for you okay i think and can you yeah. send the syllabus in the group as well sure yeah, yeah i can do that after the class after this i'll just post this in the group okay okay any other questions so i think tayaba for you you have not